This is OCR Pro Miranda Huber, and today we're going to give you a few different tips for how to get over this wall. There's lots of different techniques that you can use, so it's nice to kind of play around and pick the one that is easiest for you or that you can be most comfortable with. So I'm gonna show you guys my method. If the wall's a little bit taller, sometimes I have to make a big jump to the top. This one is right where I can reach it, so that's good. And then what I'm gonna do is kind of dead hang on it and then I'll throw my foot up. That way I can kind of save my biceps for other obstacles in the race. And then I'll use my foot to leverage and kind of pull my body up the rest of the way. Um, so I also get my left foot up on the wall to help me get that swing for my right leg to go over. And this is how I do the eight foot wall here. I'll look for an A-frame as long as it's, you've made sure that it's uh, legal to use in the race. I'll use that just to give me a little boost off it. Another way to do the wall is to simply muscle your way over. Now, if you're not confident in your obstacle ability for later in the race, you may not want to use this technique because it's a little more tiring but it is pretty fast. You pull up, get to the top of the wall, and roll over. So the other way, if you're with a team, or if you're newer and you're not as confident and you have buddies you're doing it with, you can always rely on your teammates or your friends to help you out. 